Hello everyone, this is Gruesome Herzog. The movie we're going to talk about today is a classic from 1975. And that would be Jaws, the godfather of oncoming shark movies. I can remember watching this probably back in 1983 on VHS for the very first time. Um, wow. Back then it was like one of these cool, awesome shark movies, which it still is, of course. But technology today is quite different back then, because back then it was a little bit different. But watching this movie again, after all these years, it still holds up as one of the all-time classic man-eating film. It's Anyways, here's the storyline. When a killer shark unleashes a chaos on a beach community of Cape Cod, it's up to the local sheriff, a marine biologist, and an old seafarer to hunt the beast down. Directed by Steven Spielberg, written by Peter Benchley and Carl Gottlieb. Here is the awesome cast. Roy Scheider as Brody, Robert Shaw as Quint, Richard Dreyfus as Hooper, Lorraine Gary as Ellen Brody, Murray Hamilton as Vaughn, Carl Gottlieb as Meadows, Jeffrey Kramer as Hendrix, Susan Backlenny as Chrissy, Jonathan Fillet as Cassidy, and the cast goes on. Now, folks, I don't know about yous, but I'll be 55 this year, so I was, you know, I started catching, being able to watch movies and understand them, probably like around the 1979-80 era, and I can remember my parents talking about this film, and, and of course, you know, when you played on TV, it was cut up a little bit with commercials. So then eventually when the VHS error came around, I was able to watch it, like I said, probably like around 1983 or something like that. Could be a little sooner. And Mal, I loved this film back then, and I re-ventured again about six years ago, and I just watched it again. And I figured, you know, what the hell, I'll give it a review. The shark in this film is so scary back then that if you look at it now, you know, it's quite different than the movies today because a lot of it's all computer generated or however. But this is true marksmanship. When you see, I'm assuming a metal shark somewhat. I can remember the one scene is very popular that you see the shark, it's on the back of the boat, on the boat, tipping the boat, and you can see... Um, things sliding towards it in its mouth or whatever. That was cool. Now, I don't know if they would try that same thing today, how it would look. It probably wouldn't look as cool as it does back then. Because obviously the technology back then wasn't the same it is now, obviously. No brainer. So you have Roy Scheider, Brody, who is the, is the sheriff in town. And he knows something's wrong about a shark but nobody wants to listen to him you have Quint you have Hooper Dreyfus comes in he's an, an uh, expert and they're trying to figure out what it is what kind of shark it is or what it is period and then that's how the story goes unfolds now the Jaws 2 which I'm going to review also but again if you haven't seen this especially the young generation you youngsters need to watch a classic shark movie. Now, you might turn your nose up at it compared to the shark films today, but you really got to check it out. Basically, you have a shark that's just hunting, that's killing, that wants a piece of Brody. You know, he wants to... So, it's Brody goes after him. It's a fight for survival to kill Jaws. Brilliant film, shot very well. I love the scenery. I love the scenery in this film. It's just a classic from 75. You see the old style clothes, the old style shoes, hairdo, glasses. It's a fucking fun film. It's not just about the film, it's what you see around it as well. That being said, this is Gruesome Herzog. I give this movie an easy 10 out of 10. One of my favorite all-time shark movies ever is Jaws, 1975. This is Gruesome Herzog, and I'm out here.